I grew up in a home where food was just tremendously important. And my folks entertained. I describe it as being a little kid and being at this perfect hip height view of looking up and watching the way people feel when someone welcomes the men to their home and takes care of them. The point where I realized how this would connect uh, with, with what I would ultimately come to do as a high school kid, my favorite way to throw a party was, oh, my mom's out of town. I'm gonna throw, not like a rager, but a dinner party. And I would like you know, cook steaks and make this beautiful tomato salad. And, and they would get the biggest kick out of it. Like, oh my God, our parents don't cook this well. What's greater than connecting with something that you love to do that makes the people around you feel the way you wanna feel every day. So I think that was my first connection with um, entering the field of hospitality and cooking. If you run a kitchen, if you are the owner of a restaurant, you have to be a leader. The important part of that is being the person who can always show up. So you start as an employer people can count on, and then you decide what is the message. And to me, I always want to find a way for folks to feel welcome to what we're doing. We wanna invite you to the table. I don't believe there's any version of craft that is ever held so tightly that you never want anyone to see it. I believe craft is something that must be shared. I think that Pools has this really special magic of being this double horseshoe bar where people can't help but engage with the people next to them. And there are rubs these elbow rubs of how people have sat there for years. I think that, you know, a big part of my story is acknowledging of, of the importance of the history of this place that I think is so special to Raleigh and looking at what the community needed and, you know, wanting to serve that. And so now, we have this beautiful story of owning the building next door, which is Poolside Pies. And we named it that to acknowledge its relationship with one of the oldest restaurants, one of the oldest buildings in downtown Raleigh. And Poolside tells the story that we won't let up. You know, we bought this building. We will not let anyone ever destroy the history of, of, of this space. You know, I'm very proud to get to go to work with, with a team of folks who work every day to work to share a feeling like I felt in my home as a child.